Hey yeah, folks, and we came in here with a brand new episode of Let's Play as Zek Rob. Yeah, yeah. X3, Farm's Legacy. I was going to say Xenon, I think. Because I have, um, there's not much to this whole area. Um, so there was really just Holy Vision, which has two more solar power plants. You have this one up here. Um, but yeah. Uh, So this station has a combat mission. It's take part in a patrol over two sectors. And the targets are Xenon. So I'll take that and hope for the best. Um, so there's probably going to be Xenon somewhere. And you, you won't have anything for sale. Neither will you. Um, so I shall disable that guidance. Holy Vision Beta, which I think is the one I'm in. Yeah, it is. It's the one I'm in. Um, what do you want? You want me to scan for illegal wares? I have a feeling enemy or people with illegal wares turn hostile. Incoming um, dolphins landed. Energy cell. Don't have any energy cells left. Neither do you. Um. Because I'm going to have the dolphin buy some energy cells. The Demeter is on its way up to the Paranid equipment dock. Um, so that it can... Uh, Xenon N. Um, get... So that it can get some upgrades with the equipment. Um, Xenon N. Target is now in firing range. Alert, alert. missile oh, you closing. Fucking bastard. On you little prick, stop flying around. Xenon N. Xenon N. Autopilot off. Alert. Missile closing. Xenon N. Priest Emperor Czar, our Priest Duke offers grateful thanks for your aid. As a reward, you get 500 credits. You are being promoted. If we can get a Xenon N to Beal, that'd be nice, but... Unless I've changed things in this one. Pretty sure that's dependent on your combat rank. Just like being able to buy ships is dependent on your trade rank. No 
aim. And what are you Soiling on? M beta. Guess that Incoming cluster over there has um dolphin it can stay there for the time being. You are talking to you we I shall transmit the data to you now. That's kill kill a yaki boy. You are talking and you. what are you wanting? You're wanting the stuff. Um and there's a uh Pirate Perseus. Perseus with a cluster fuck. Um I still need to patrol this sector, whoop, sorry about that, wrong button. Um, so, we fly around stations. You should hopefully see. Ah, oh, there we go. And now south. We actually have a satellite in south. Or, well, not south, in that sector. Um, hmm. Entering Holy Vision Delta. Control Holy Vision Delta. Well, I saw some before. Over here somewhere. There they are. Xenon N. Xenon and well, that one's fucked. Um yeah, I got taken out by fighter drones. So hopefully hopefully you can get this one. Target is now in firing range. Being promoted. Greenhorn fight rank. Sweet. Um, Military outpost. So, any more? Uh, that needs to be claimed. That sounds like it's not abandoned. Um, you want a patrol three. You know what? Yeah, go on. Go for it. Patrol the holy sector alpha. That's oh, going to take me all the way through there. Um, right. So there should probably be more um, Xenon in here now, because I've taken another patrol mission, and they tend to spawn. There we go. Xenon N. So this is going to be like double Xenon the N. double the income. Is now in firing range. So I should get money for this one, plus, you know, this, this mission I've just picked up, plus the mission I already had. Stop moving, damn it. Let me shoot you!
Priest Emperor Zar, our Priest Duke offers grateful thanks for your aid. As a reward, you get 500 credits. That's a wasp missile. Wasp missile. As is that. Wasp missile. Ah, uh, someone else must have got the Zen on. Um. No aim. So a little bit more patrol. Ah, uh, with all those. Fighter drones kicking about. I'm guessing well, that could have been the other one. Um, you know, either the first two that we came across, it could have been, you know, from that. The Argon Discoverer compared to other ships in the Argon fleet is relatively. All right, so I just want to double check my shields. Um, I do have max shielding on this ship, so that's okay. So that one should finish. I should get well, forty-five or sixty-five hundred. Um, there we go. That's that one. This one still wants me. Oh, so I need to go to Ghana. Okay, so I need to go into there, then probably fight two ships. There is no um, time limit. And they might just get killed on their own anyway. Entering Holy Vision Gamma. So these are the two... Um, Paranid Demeter Tanker. That's going to be expensive, not worth it. 2.6 million. Because it had shields and it's full hull. I have a feeling I've maybe got one of them anyway. But um, I would have had to double check that, of course. Um, so, there's a remote guide of warhead. How much do they sell the for? Remote guide. Um, the remote what guided, size? Remote guided warhead. That, that Xenon end can wait. That's twenty something thousand. You know what? I think it's nearby. Xenon N. And someone else is fighting them anyway. Target is now in firing range. No aim. Punk ass bitch stole my kill. Remote guided warhead. Well, he's not stealing my flipping cargo either. Or two as well. Oh, yeah. Cargo bay now contain remote guided war remote I guided mean, music. warhead. Remove. I so the meter tanker. That's what was for sale. We have the dolphin tanker. Um, yeah, even 2.6 million. It's not worth it. Uh, um, so where is this? I, I would imagine the other Xenon N got obliterated already. Considering, you know, there's like M4s and stuff. What, what, what are you? Pirate, you're a pirate. Please. So you're up around that area. 
I'm not taking on an M4 and an M5. Um, Xenon N. Target, target is now in firing range. Incoming message. But somebody's landed where they need to be. Nobody steals this one too. In the name of Priest Emperor Zar, our priest do thanks for your aid. As a reward, you get 500 credits. You are being promoted. The meter has reached, so you can have three commands offered. Um, yeah, I'm, I'll maybe come back to that. Um, so, Target is now in firing range. we seem to be using fragmentation bomb launchers. Anymore? Transorbital accelerator, homing vision, delta. Xenon um, the answer N. to that is yes, another one. Possibly another two? No, just the one. Alright, he seems to be going, going straight for me, so. Um, he's going to be trying to blast my head off as soon as he's in range. Target is now in firing range. And I may have to take a plunge and um, buy an M4 or an M5. I've been, I suppose I could make a scorpion, but then I need shields. There's really not much in the way of, you know, available equipment. Alert. Missile closing. No aim. Incoming message. Okay, the meter's finished. Um, navigation software. Navigation command software adds more Take advanced navigation. So we'll get that. Sure. Navigation command or software. Or collector, it might be worth getting. Installed. Special this command. Is a software extension for any ship. Collect wires, yeah. Special command um, software, Mark 1, installed. Let me look at that as well. And then I want you to not go anywhere for the time being. Um, that's uh, because I was going to send him. Actually, what are the. Uh, solar, po solar power. Yeah, okay. You can come to. Um, solar power plant. M beta. Docking granted. Command accepted. Oh, has the dolphin? Yeah, that's close and enough. And then you can go there, granted. drop them off. And then you'll fly up and dock at the equipment dock. So, um, I will probably...
Hmm. Entering Holy Vision Delta. Like I mentioned, it might be worth building a scorpion for myself. Um, let's have a wee quick gander. A forerunner of this ship fought in the Boron campaign and proved to be a pilot favorite. Like most other split ships, this model focuses on... I need pulse beam emitters. This space station is highly... This outpost serves as a remote operating base for military ships. Well-connected pilots can purchase advanced military technology. There's really, as, a, as I was mentioned earlier on, there's really not a whole lot of equipment available to get um, an upgrade on a ship. So... Entering Holy Vision Beta. I may just have to grin and bear it for now. Um, and try and do these in an M5. Decent shields for an M5. Good speed. I could go get the other two guns. Um. Because I do have two more Xenon impulse ray emitters. Um, they are in the uh, headquarters. So, so I could go and get them. But I've not really been paying Target too much attention. Decent energy use. I don't... Mm, Probably more guns as you run out of energy faster, which could put yourself in a predicament. I suppose it's just management, really. Um, energy management. Uh, the mission does look like it's dedicated pirates I need to kill, which again annoys me. In the name of Priest Emperor Zar, our Priest Duke offers grateful thanks for your aid as Cargo Bay now contains Mosquito Missile. Mosquito missile installed. So is that that the mosquito locked on, right? It requires a target. So you can use mosquito the the fence is a thing. Um Xenon N. Basically you have mosquito missiles in your cargo and you use that target to um target at other missiles incoming. Um I so use that there to target other missiles that are locked onto you, and then it just obliterates the missiles because they're dirt cheap. You can even build your own station to mass produce them. This is getting lengthy, this episode. But at least it's mostly just all combat. Um, with a wee bit of flying around trying to find the bastards. Oh, um. The Thunderbolt. The Silkworm missile combines mm. quantum technology with a warhead capable of destroying even heavily protected targets. Okay, anyway. Come on, send me to the next sector, will ya? One thing I might do? If it's available. This outpost, sir. This base station 
Pounds, um, equipment dogs are locations in I command, yeah. I think Mark II gives me better auto aim. This can be handy, especially for obviously combat. Um, there's more Xenon. There's three Xenon. Where are they? There they are. I need to be careful not to go into the middle of them. Xenon because then message. I could become their prime target. target is now in firing no, it's not a good idea. Like, you know, several people's prime target. It's not so bad when you have one person to try and dodge. But when you have two or three or potentially more. Um, it can be tricky. Unless you're in... Just in a ship that is so heavily shielded that it just takes a pound in. Message. Must be both ships in where they need to be then. No aim. Paranid Casino. Cargo bay now contains Rapier Missile. Paranid Casino. Yeah, they're attacking the casino, so if I can casino jump in. N is now in firing range. Priest Emperor Zar, our Priest Duke offers grateful thanks for your aid. As a reward, you get 500 credits. Cargo Bay now contains Mosquito Missile. Yeah, so that's a dolphin. Need to be careful I don't accidentally blast the um it is now in firing range. Casino. Are you gonna poop him? Do I have the Perseus? I don't think I do. Um, it's just Octopus I have. Perseus, is that the M4, Perseus? The it's Perseus an M3. Is the successor to the Prometheus. And it's 69% hull. So it doesn't have shields. Alpha. And it might be affordable. You are talking. Yeah. 
344,000. Ship computer control yeah. transferred. Um. Energy set. Alright, now you are going to come. You're gonna go to there. And you are going to. Yeah, you might. Um. Docking granted. Right, so there's a reason I spent three hundred forty-four thousand on an M3. Um, the Perseus is the successor to the Prometheus. Its first test run ended in embarrassment for the Paranid when the Perseus. Beyond the fact that it can, uh, you know, use. Docking granted. Um, plasma burst generators. Yeah. Entering Holy Vision Alpha. Yeah, just patrol this place, and then we'll be done with the patrol and with the um, episode. Xenon N. Again, I don't want to be the only target that they have. You are talking? I will transmit the data to you now. So if I let them get to the um Okay, there's other ships there, so maybe they'll um, you know, target some of them. Xenon N Alert. Missile closing. I am the only target that they have. Um, Alert. Missile closing. This is, this is not good. Solar power. Successfully docked. In the name of Priest Emperor Zar, our Priest Duke welcomes all friends of the Paranid aboard. Connection to local trading network I'm gonna let my, uh, This is probably a bit cheaty, <laughs> but... I'm going to let my shields regenerate. I'm on 89% hull. Um, okay, there we go. Autopilot off. Xenon Hopefully N. now. Um, they'll focus on... Is now in firing oh, they're still focusing on me. Or he might have been aiming at the station. I don't know. Um, Hopefully that'll keep the other ones distracted for the time being. I really do like the Xenon ships. So... Maybe we'll try and focus on trying to get the last one to... a side deal, but it's more like short circuit. That'd actually be a good source of... Um, Materials as well, if you sort of just go and uh, scrap them. In the name of Priest Emperor Zar, our Priest Duke offers grateful thanks for your aid. As a reward, you get 500 credits. Give me your ship. No aim. Whew. Right. So there's a heavy transport over here. 
Why? Paranid high tech transport. Where are you going? The Perseus is the successor to the Prometheus. Its first test run ended in a. Is there another station up around here? He's just chilling. Maybe that's it. Okay. Um. See him again. Xenon N. He's coming straight for Xenon me. N. He's. Xenon about. N. He's coming straight for me. Um. And I can I run them, so I think I'm okay. Paranid high tech transporter. I'll just make them have to turn. Xenon N. Xenon N. Someone down at the gate as well. Xenon N. Hmm. Target is now in firing range. Well, fly into the station. Target left Hit them. target Shit. is now alert. Missile closing. Target left firing range. Xenon N. Target is now in firing range. Alert, alert. Missile um. closing. I'm going to call it there and try and, well, finish this up off screen, or maybe I'll just chuck it out at the end. But if you enjoyed, hit the like button, subscribe for more, and I shall see you either in a few minutes or hopefully in the next episode. Peace.